guys, this is your boy Showtime, you know what time it is. You know what time it is? So back again with another one, you feel me? I've been out of the YouTube game for a minute. <laughs> This video is gonna be about the top 10 series you can watch on Netflix during this quarantine season because everybody is indoors, you feel me? So, but alright, so this is not in any particular order, but I'm gonna go straight into it. So, the first series I think is a mass watch during this quarantine season is Money Heist. Money Heist has created a buzz for a long time in the uh, season 5 my bad season 5 just came out and that shit is crazy so if you just started you're about to have mad fun with this one you feel me it's a it's an amazing and they have this song Bella Ciao, Bella Ciao, Bella Ciao. you feel me all right so i'ma play the trailer so you can see it and check it out all right boom my name is tokyo but when this story began, that wasn't my name. Don't move, or I'll blow you in half! How it's stealing about 2.4 billion euros sound. Mom, I'm thinking about going on a trip. No one has ever hit that hard. Not even in New York, London, or Monte Carlo. So if my picture needs to be in the news again, at least it'll be for the greatest heist in history. And every family in this country will be asking, what are they doing now? What are we robbing? The Royal Mint of Spain. It's absolutely imperative that the police don't have any idea what we're doing. But be very careful, because the second any blood is shed, we'll no longer be Robin Hoods, but just a bunch of plain motherfucking punks. It's time! So just trust us and obey. But all that peace was only the calm before the storm. Things were about to get so fucked up that we came very close to losing it all. Thief. And murderer. Yeah. Told you, that shit. Wow. So that's Money High. The next series I think is a must watch for this season is All American. I just got put on by All American by my baby girl. And that shit is crazy. Guys, so I'm gonna play that and you guys check it out. The season two just came out, and that's just wild. Like, just get, just get into it. All right, look to me. If I get the signal, just give me the ball fast. I see you boys in the end zone. Spencer James. I'm Billy Baker, varsity coach, Beverly High. You're impressive out there. I want you to come play for me. Play for you? Yes, sir, for me. All right, South Crenshaw, y'all got a strong team, but Beverly Hills can offer you something that Crenshaw can't. Better education at a safer school. What's up with you and this kid, Dad? Why do you care so much? I come from Spencer's neighborhood. You have no idea what that's like. You got the goods on and off the field. I knew it from the first day I met you, right here in this park. Boy, I see it. You gotta go. You're proud of where you're from, but tell me that going to Beverly isn't the best thing for you, baby. I need you to do me a solid. Take Spencer under your wing. Help him connect to the fellas. Yo, you must be Spencer. No, bring him in the fold. What the hell are you doing? I'm picking you up, man. In your red car? In your red hat? You're gonna get your head blown off. <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> Come on, dog. He's yeah. <laughs> and remember, you're here on an academic permit. No fighting, or it's over, one and done. I got faith in you, Spencer. See you practice. Hey, come on in. It's okay if you don't have a computer, just pair up with a classmate for now. Um, you can share with me. See, so you've met my tortured, odd left sister. 
Real ray of sunshine, isn't she? Come on, meet the crew. This here is Layla. Up there is Lucy, JJ, and Asher. You and Asher play the same position. So lay it on me, man. Crips or bloods? Excuse me? I'm dying to check out a crip walk for real. You wouldn't know a damn crip walk if you're hitching the white ass. I think he's intimidated by you. They all are. I would not have recruited him if I didn't think anybody on the team had half of his potential. He needs some time to adjust, but he's going to bring it home for us. Come meet my mom. You must be Spencer. I am making my famous gazpacho recipe right now. Tell me about these Beverly Hills girls. Like, they skinny. Skinny. Skinny? Hey, come here often. Every Wednesday after the club. Oh, really? <laughs> you seeing this? Yeah, we need to get rid of him. He's the real deal, right, Dad? He's gonna bring it home for you? I got Spencer here like you asked. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah. What are you up to? Just welcoming the new guy, babe. Come on, the night is young, man. Y'all set me up, make me look bad? You got me confused with somebody else, bro. Yeah, go back to Crenshaw. What you say? Say that again, bro. Hey, 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 hey. I ain't come here for this. Well, you better not disrespect me. You came here to play football. Am I right or am I wrong? That place just isn't who I am. And this is? No, you decide who you want to be. Pick up your damn helmet. Watch your back, Beverly. I asked you to give yourself a chance at something more. This is the only way to do it. What drives me to play is my anger. I fight for every damn step I take. If you can make something of yourself, Maybe someday I can too. Welcome to Beverly Hills, Spencer. Daniel. You say you play because you're angry. I'm asking you to play for something bigger now. Next series I think you definitely should check out is A Letter for the King, if I'm getting it right. Season two, no, I don't think the season two is out, but it's just one season that is out right now. And as soon as I got put onto that, I was glued to it to the end of the season. So let's check out this trailer.
you know where he is? Hiding. From who? something that he shouldn't have. Alright, so the next one I think you should definitely get on to is how to get away with murder. Yo, if I tell you, as soon as I started watching this, I was picking no calls, no FaceTime, no dance classes. No, oh yeah, that's me. Yeah, no FaceTime, no nothing, because that shit gets you glued to your screens, you feel me? I saw this season one, that shit was crazy. I was like, whoa. Oh, oh, Letting go of it all. I was fearful, but I go on. Find your seat. You don't want to be a sitting duck when the shooter gets here. What terrible things you've done in your life up to this point, but clearly your comments out of balance to get assigned to my class. I'm Professor Annalise Keating, and this is Criminal Law 100, or as I prefer to call it. How to get away with murder. Here we go. I will not be teaching you how to study the law or theorize about it, but rather how to practice it in a courtroom, like a real lawyer. Every year I choose four students to come work for me. This assignment is used to help me decide who that is. I'll go. Find the defense that will free our client. Step one, discredit the witnesses. You should really pay attention. You might learn something. Are you colorblind? Yes. The rest of you step up your game. Step two, introduce a new suspect. How'd you get this? <sighs> it wasn't exactly legal. And we just have to get creative. Step three, we bury the evidence. You got him to lie on the stand. I did my job. Everything after this moment will not only determine your career, but life. You can spend it in a corporate office drafting contracts and hitting on chubby paralegals before finally putting a gun in your mouth. Or you can join my firm and become someone you actually like. I want to be her. Professor, oh my god. Thank you for keeping this between us. You're a misogynistic ass. Stop screwing the students. How'd you get that email? I don't kiss and tell. The body stays where it no, is. No, the body is what gets us caught. Either we all agree or we stop right now. Just do it. It's the only way to destroy the DNA. That's how you get away with murder.